Tomorrow, we're so excited to finally, after about a year of waiting for this tank, the 900 drop down's coming. Uh, that tank will replace the 200 gallon cube that was there. We love that cube. We're gonna love this 900 more. It's nine feet long by two and a half feet, and then drops down to four feet. The reason why we did it, well, we needed something to match in grandness to the big tank. So here we are, getting ready. I have asked you already how to escape it in the group. Um, can't wait till tomorrow. Really excited about this. Something's gonna be on that wall soon. A 900 gallon drop down that we're finally waiting for. It's been about a year. drop down we're going to uh, uncrate it off the flatbed rig it on the crane swing it over the house into the stairwell and then feather it through the door into some dollies and then we'll lift it again in the basement and get it over the pipes that are coming through the floor uh, it's not a good day did you see the crack and did you see the two by four get broke I mean, every time we ship anything, it's stressful, whether it be livestock or <laughs> glass or... I mean. Apparently, uh, the tank I've been waiting for for about a year, there was a crack in it. So were these custom tanks take a long time to build? Is that what yeah, it is? Yeah, so... It, well, we got, this, like, I felt like... I know. So unfortunately, today, we went to uh, pull the drop-down tank off the flatbed and we noticed that there was a giant crack moving from the drop-down portion up to the top corner of the tank. So, made today's events very short. So obviously there was a loading issue. They told me this was a difficult delivery because the tank can't leave the stand, but somewhere between, well, we don't know where. The tank is cracked, it's not usable. It's gonna have to go back to planet or rebuilt again. There's always going to be something unexpected, no matter how well you plan for it and how much you try to avoid it. So it's like really about diligence and trying to look two, three, four steps ahead so that you can be prepared for these problems. Okay, this thing was supposed to sit here. We were going to plumb it, maybe scape it. We had so many other things to do in the house. There wasn't expected to be water in by this Christmas, I don't think. I mean, we had a hardscape at first. We didn't even figure out closed loops and drains. Yeah. So it would have been sitting here empty anyway. So where does this leave the 900 gallon drop down? Probably won't be another year. It'll probably be here significantly shorter. We're gonna source some glass domestically instead of China. And we're gonna have Planet rebuild the tank shortly. So frankly, uh, we'll work on other things now. Don't forget to like and subscribe so we can bring more of this content to you.